Now to continue my mission, herding the Loba's yaks to the safety of an ancient city. But traveling in mountains can be tough, slow, and frustrating. It's almost impossible to follow a straight line, and steep climbs are hard to avoid. Between me and the mountain city lies a 600-foot tall ridge. This climb will be tough and exposes me to a new mountain danger, altitude sickness. The yaks are built for this mountain air. Their blood can hold much more oxygen than regular cattle, but I'm way out of my comfort zone. This is getting about as steep as I can go. I think I can speak for the horse too. Come on, bud. Up here, the air pressure is 40% lower than at sea level, so I'm getting significantly less oxygen with each breath. Telltale symptoms can develop as the brain struggles to cope. The condition can rapidly escalate and can kill within hours. Uh, climbed a lot of mountains in my life. But this one is a whole different league. The higher I go, I'd feel the lack of oxygen. Sometimes, no matter how hard you try, you can't match the locals. The Loba are born with unique genetic adaptations that help them survive the extreme altitudes. If you like what you've just seen, Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.